Hello everyone, Jubilee here. This is the first episode of my Ultra Sun Nuzlocke. As you can see, I'm joined by my friend Appa, and we're gonna be playing through Ultra Sun Nuzlocke style. So let's see how it goes. Be sure to leave a like on the video and subscribe if you haven't already, because those are things that are very important. All right. Hello, Kaku, Kakui, Kakui. Hello. Good afternoon. Wait, I need a better voice for him. Um, so the day has finally come that you're moving to Alola. That's probably pretty good. Alola is a region made up of several islands. That could be the reason the region is chock full of nothing but rare Pokemon, yeah! Okay, we should just click through this. I just want to get started. This is going to be really long. I'm not reading all this. Mm -mm, not happening. You find them all over, of course. I already know. Blah, blah, blah. Fly. He is pretty cute, I will say. As far as professors go, I have a crush on him. Is that wrong? I don't know. Oh! Oh, I don't want to be a boy! Okay, I don't want to be a boy. So I played as, I think, this girl last time? Or maybe, no, I think I played as the blonde one last time. I can't remember. I guess I'll be... I want to be the dark haired one. I think I chose this one last time, but I'm choosing it again, so I'm sorry. <laughs> I'm not very original. All right, what should my name be? Oh, uh, where is my stylist? Okay, it's in here, where it's actually supposed to be for once. Okay, my name will be, of course. Wait, should I name myself something normal or something silly? Hmm. Nah, I should just name myself something normal. Come on, Julie, you gotta get off to a normal start. Don't be weird. Jubilee, we just gotta get started, so let's just name ourselves Jubilee, which is my real, actual name. Good for me. So, you go by Jubilee. That is what I go by. We'll come up with something more unique and clever next time. <laughs> Alright, good buddy. You're my good buddy, too. Aww, look at that little pick up you're so cute. You know what would be cool? If I got a shiny in this playthrough. I've never gotten a shiny in a Sun and Moon playthrough before. But, well, okay, Gen 7 playthrough. I know this is not Sun and Moon, it's Ultra Sun and Moon. But, still. It's my turn. Oh! I forgot about background. Mm. I'll add it afterwards. I'll add it post-production. There's not going to be any, uh, any system sounds in this playthrough. Um, or at least in this particular episode, because I have not figured out how to do that yet. So I'm just gonna play like some Glitch City in the background instead. Hope you guys are okay with that and can tolerate it. That's just, that's just where we're at right now. Oh, look at Lily running through, running through the place right now. She's trying to figure out what's going on. I probably should have checked to make sure that my recording was working properly. I'm sure it is. I'm sure it's working fine. I'm sure nothing is wrong. Ah, oh, these men are dangerous, Lily. Stay back. I'll be honest, when I first played through Ultra Moon, I was convinced these peeps were evil until the very end. I realized that in retrospect I should have known, but uh, I, I don't know, they said some pretty evil sounding things, if I remember correctly, early on in the game that made me think they were evil, so. Don't judge me. I'm not, I'm not very good at like knowing what's going on in things. Just leave me alone. I am what I am. I am who I am, people. Three months later. Ooh. Time has gone by. Time has at long last passed. Let's see what we get. Ooh, who should my starter be? I haven't even thought about this yet. Okay. I'm thinking... Pop Leo. <laughs> yeah, I, no, I totally want Pop Leo, actually. Yeah, no, it's definitely going to be Pop Leo. The one that I get to choose, I'm going with my beautiful princess, Primarina, the queen. She's beautiful. I love her. If she was real, I would have her as a Pokemon. I would choose her every time. So if she was real, and this was real life, I would always choose her. So we're going to choose her today. Ah, can't you just feel that warmth the first day spent under a Lola sun? That's nice. It's so warm and bright here. But that's enough of that. Time to unpack all these boxes. <laughs> Meow, go get Jubilee for me, would you? Meow. Yeah. 
go get Jubilee for me, please. Mm hmm. What's she doing? What's she doing right now? She better not be sleeping, lazing about in her room. Okay, can we just talk about the Snorlax chair for a moment? Okay? I want this Snorlax bean bag so badly, and I have wanted it for like at least a year or whenever they introduced that they were actually going to sell an official Snorlax bean bag. I have been wanting one, and I can't find it. Well, okay, okay, it's not that I can't find it. I can find it. It's just that it's $300, you guys. <laughs> it's $300, and I want it so badly. Okay. That's enough of those tears. Oh, okay, now I can get up. All right. Okay, let's just uh, cruise on through as quickly as we can. Okay, yes. Mm -hmm. The house, kitchen, <clears throat> there's food. I probably should have just not even bothered recording this, but maybe you guys are being entertained by my company and don't care what's happening. You were out like a light, weren't you? You ought to be full of energy by now. And just, and just look, it's already daytime here. It's completely the opposite of Kanto. But then we are so far away here. No, no. Okay, shh. Oh, yeah, I'm really excited. I've burped twice, but I'm excited. Blah, blah, blah. Everything's great. Blah, blah, blah. Bag and hat are in my room. Okay, let's go get it. Let's go get my bag and hat and uh, start our adventure, guys. Cool. There it is. Come on. <clears throat> Ooh. Slowly. Go. I'm ready for my uh, adventure. Mm -hmm. I see. Yeah, I look good. I get it. I look sexy. Let's go. I actually really like this outfit. I think it's really, really cute. I would wear this in a minute. Like the entire thing. I would wear. No question about that. It's adorable. But, anyways. Cool, let's go. Let's get our adventure started in Alola. There's so many Pokemon to meet. Let's go get our starter. Alright. I think I'm gonna get it up here. Oh yeah, this is totally where I need to go. Watch it, cuz. It's dangerous to get too close to a Pokemon while it's using one of its moves. Wait, oh. Oh. What? Okay, apparently that's not the way. Yeah, I can't even remember which way I'm supposed to go this way. Get too close to any Pokemon. Route one, okay. Here we go. Here's where I need to be. Oh no! Oh no! Something's coming out of the tall grass. What could it be? Oh! 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 Look at this terrifying creature! Definitely going to bring death and destruction upon me. It's the size of a tiny little cat, but it's. It's evil. Okay. It's gonna take me out. Ho! The prettiest and best was last. Yeah, 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 he's not gonna take on those guys. Those guys would wreck him. All three together, you would die if you were a young goose. Ooh, what if we got a shiny? What if we got a shiny right now? A shiny starter? I know that's not gonna happen. But like I can't like I can't help but be like, but it could happen though. It could though. Hang on, I know you. You're Jubilee, right? You okay? I saw you get attacked like that. I was scared. I was so scared. I was terrified of that creature. That was a demon. A demon in the grass. Blah 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 blah. Give me my first Pokemon. Blah blah blah. You never forget. In the corner, look in the grass, bite you. Yep, it's not fun when they bite you. That's rude. All right, let's get our beautiful seal baby on our team. Yeah, I don't want you. You suck. Blah, 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 blah. I don't want you either. Okay. You see, the fact of the matter is, one of these Pokemon will become your first partner. Woo! So enthusiastic. Blah, blah, blah. Maybe that's why you're my cousin. Am I really his cousin? That's what I want to know. Are we really cousins, or is he just saying that because he just calls everyone his cousin for some reason? Hmm. Oh, I know who I'm choosing. My baby Pop Leo. It's too bad you can't tell whether they're shiny in this screen. Oh, what am, what am I naming it? 
I didn't even know what he has just now. I was just spamming the letter A. All right. Oh, look at me with my pretty, pretty partner. Oh, it's so cute. I love it. It's perfect. All right. All right, that's enough. Yes, we met each other. I chose Poplio, the queen. I got gotcha. you. Would I like to give Poplio a nickname? Of course I would. You have to always nickname your Pokemon in a Nuzlocke so you get more attached to them. Uh, oh, it's a boy. Okay. I'm gonna name it... Bobo. No. That's not a good name. I'm gonna name it... Hmm... I'm gonna name it... Uh, it's a boy, so I'm, okay, Bobo was fine. Let's just go with the first thing that comes into our mind. I think that's a good strategy for a Nuzlocke. <laughs> Bobo it is. <laughs> Wait, I can't enter Bobo? Uh, Bobo? Bobo. Is that weird? I think that's a little bit weird. Bobo? Okay, Bobo it is. Pretend that E's not there. It forced me because it said it was an inappropriate name, which I don't know why. Maybe that's a swear word in another language, I don't know. Okay, I went with Poplio. Woo, what a fun looking team you got there. Of course I do, Mr. Kukui. Kukui. All right. All right, then, Icky Town. Uh, blah, 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 meet the Kahuna. Gift he's gonna give me, everyone's gonna be happy. Blah, 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 blah. <laughs> Icky Town is right up there. Good to know, man. Thank you for that info. That's good to know. Let's go to Icky Town. Let's find this Pokemon. Is he gonna give me a Pokeball? Ooh. Bork, bork, bork. Did he give me Pokeballs? Oh, I don't know. I don't think so. I don't know. Let me look at my Pokemon to see if it's shiny. Bobo, are you shiny? Uh, Bobo is not shiny. It has the ability... Oh! That's a good ability. I mean, that, not ability, sorry. It has a good nature, right? Do they always have a good nature? What is your nature? Modest. That's a great nature for a Poplio. Okay. Perfect nature Poplio coming at you. All right, that's great news. Wow, lucky. Okay, let's save the game. It's not shiny, but it has a perfect nature. So, I'll take it. Pretty cool, huh? Uh-oh, please don't be a shiny. I don't think I have any Pokeballs. Okay. Get me away. Oh, I probably should have killed that thing, actually, for the experience. Uh, I'm already failing at this Nuzlocke. That's bad. Alrighty. Doo -doo -doo -doo. What is that? Do I have Pokeballs? Let me look in my bag. Did he give me them? Like, I don't rem recall him doing the whole walkthrough of how to use a Pokeball. I don't have any Pokeballs. Right? Um... Yeah, I don't, I don't think so. I don't know how you tell. Okay. <clears throat> well, I don't want to freaking walk in any grass then. Ooh, it's How. Hello, How. How are you doing today? Which Pokemon are you going to choose as your partner? Have you decided? Of course I decided, How. Look how cute he is. Oh, you just want to give him a hug. Oh yeah, I'm How. I couldn't wait for us to pick our partners, blah, blah, blah. I already picked mine. It's a cute little Poplio. Whoa, your Poplio is so cool. Of course it is. Way cooler than whatever you chose. Mm -hmm. Then my partner will be Litten. I choose you. Alola, 
friend. I, I decided ages ago, ages ago that you're the one I wanted to have an adventure with. We're gonna do some awesome stuff together. Just you wait and see. Aww. Yeah, we are. Mm -hmm. He's gonna take care of me. Or whatever. Alright then, Rowlet. Everybody, time to get back in your balls now. Alright, getting back in our balls. Yeah. He's gonna really enjoy this, apparently. That's good. I'm glad one of us is gonna enjoy this now. Because I'm sure I'm not gonna enjoy it. Especially when you hurt my beautiful princess baby with your fire moves. I'm angry already. Here, drink of water. What will Bobo do? Hmm. Bobo will fight with a water gun. Proud of you, Bobo. Really proud of you already. As your newest trainer, I'm very proud of everything you've done here today. Alright. Well, this Litton's about to die. What did it just do to me? My attack fell. Well, I'm not a at physical attacker. I'm a special attacker, Litton, so you're just dumb. You're just dumb is what's wrong with you. You didn't even try to win that. Ooh, a whole level in one go. Very good. Looking through. All right. On to the next thing. Whoa, that was awesome, Jubilee. You and Pop Leo were both so cool. Thank you, pal. You've got to have that kind of battles where everyone has fun. You and your partner Pokemon too, you know? Thanks, Hal. Right on, Jubilee! You and Hal both brought out the best of your partners and pulled off some spectacular moves, yeah? Okay, I don't care. Let's move along. You should totally check out Icky Town, man! Maybe I don't want to. Maybe I want you to give me some freaking Pokeballs so that if I find a shiny, I don't have to, like, just kill it! Did you ever think about that? Kukui, if that is your real name. Hmm. Hmm. Alright, and we're here! It's Icky Town! We're finally to Icky Town, where the party starts, oh yeah! I apologize. I just, I just apologize. For my behavior. Looks like the Kahuna's nowhere to be found, though. Oh no, the Kahuna. Where is he? Is he okay? Did he die? Oh, rip Kahuna. I'm gonna go stop by home for a sec. I gotta show my mom my litten. Go ahead, Hal. Go ahead. Go home, Hal. Nobody cares. Okay, head through the village, talk with Coco, introduce yourself. Really lucky. Might see him myself. I will be really lucky. Spoiler alert. Spoiling the future of the game because that is the greatest spoiler. I just need to get through this crap and need them to give me a freaking Pokeball, alright? Because I am a shiny hunter and if I find a freaking shiny before I get Pokeballs, I will lose my mind. I'll take you to the ruins. So please stay in the bag. We could be in trouble if anyone sees you. Uh-oh. Where's she hiding? Where's she packing? I remember back in the day when we first got Art of Lily and it was like, what's in the bag, Lily? What's in the bag, Lily? And now we know. Now we know she has a secret little uh, creature in the bag. There he is. Look how dumb he is. Look at that big smile. So excited for his life, and then oh, oh no, oh, oh, scared little, little puffy cloud. Don't be scared, I'll save you. Don't you just want to protect that? You just see it, and you're like, I must protect you. Ah, Lily, get out of my way. Lily, Lily, Cosmog is dying, and you're standing in the way. What's wrong? Blah, blah, blah. I'm gonna help if you get out of my freaking way. Mm. 
I know, I can clearly see what's happening, Lily. You don't need to give me a play-by-play. -play. Just get out of my freaking way. Okay. Oh. At long last. I get to battle it, guys. Get ready for an intense Spiro battle. This is going to be very, very intense. Okay. Water gun. The only move that is worth it, my time currently. Spiro used Leer because he's dumb. Dumb Pokemon use that move. Now you're gonna die. Bye, Spiro. Bye, Felicia. That Spiro's name is Felicia, by the way. Alright, Bobo gave some experience. Alright. Carry on my wayward son. There'll be peace when you are done. Alright. We're carrying on. Yeah, I get it. Yeah, you're tripping and falling every two steps. I understand. I'm clumsy too, it's okay. No judgment here. This is a judgment free zone. My poor little baby. Oh. Oh. Ah! oh dear. Oh, you tried to protect me, Nebby, but you did a really bad job. And nearly got us killed, but don't worry. Did you see what Tapu Koko just did to those Spiros? He just killed them all. In one go. He was just like and they died. Rip. Rip all of those Felicias. Alright. Well, you're a murderer. I just saw you murder a bunch of birds. That's awkward. I mean, if he's such a good guardian, why did he just kill all of those Spiros? That's what I want to know. Nebby, save me and return. Pew! Okay. Carrying on. On to the next one. No, shut up. Oh, a sparkling stone. You know, what's weird about this scene? There's a sparkling stone on the ground. Tapu Kogo didn't give it to me. In fact, Lily is giving it to me. Lily got it first. Lily was the one Tapu Kogo was trying to give the stone to all along. Look, she just handed me the stone right there. You see that, guys? Pokemon theories. I'm writing them right now. That's really interesting. It's at least mildly interesting, though, right? He meant to give the stone to Lily. Lily was supposed to be the Pokemon trainer. But it's a good thing that she gave it to me because we find out later on in this, uh, spoiler alert, by the way, we find out later on in this game that Lily is a horrible trainer. She's like, I want to have a Jigglypuff on my team. And it's, um, it's not even a Jigglypuff, it's like a Clefairy. I don't know what she has, but it's garbage, okay? Garbage Pokemon that are bad make up her entire team. Also, she has like two Pokemon on her team. Lily, you have six Pokemon slots. Why do you only have two? What is wrong with you? I understand liking fairy types, okay? I understand that. But there are some very good fairy type Pokemon, and she picked the worst ones. What is wrong with her? Okay, but anyways, we'll discuss that later on when we get there. Oh, Jubilee! You already met Lily, huh? She's my assistant, yeah? Alright, that's fine. You look good shirtless, by the way. I like your pecs. They're nice. And your abs. I mean, you don't have any abs, but I know you would really have abs if you existed in real life. I was just uh, taking a little stroll up Mahala Trail while I waited for him to return. Uh, he knows about your secret, Lily. Doesn't he? Or does he not? I forget who knows. The Kahuna knows, I think. Maybe he tell the Kahuna tells us. Oh, Kahuna is back! Yay, Kahuna! You are back. You are not dead. I thought you were dead. Okay. Welcome back. Ooh, look at that man with that big belly. Have I missed something? Aha! I just got caught in the middle of some brawling rock rough, that's all. Sorry, Lily, what were you saying before? I wasn't listening. <laughs> For some reason, I thought I saw Tapu Coco flying about. 
I saw him kill several Spiros. I thought he was supposed to be protecting them, but whatever. Yeah, uh-huh, blah, 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 blah. I was protecting the little creature. The little creature in my bag. Mm. Blah, blah, blah. Dude, Nebby, there's people watching. There's a bunch of people standing around. You're supposed to be a secret. She's telling me all about, don't tell anyone, Jubbly, about my secret. It's so secret that we could all die if anybody found out. Pulls the Nebby out when there's 50,000 people standing around. Gosh, Lily, like, what is wrong with you? You are so dumb, girl. Get it together. Ugh. Lily is so dumb, you guys. This is why Tapu Koko made the wrong choice giving her that sparkling stone. And she made the right choice giving it to me. Because I, I am not dumb like her. Look at that. Ne Put Nebby back in your bag, Lily, before everybody sees you. This is so dangerous. I am, I just feel uncomfortable now. We need to get past this part. Ugh. Okay. Man, are you trying to battle me again? We just battled. Uh, seriously, I mean, I want to stroll. Da -da 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 -da. Da -da -da. There's a sparkling stone in my pocket. Please take it half. Okay, honestly, this part scared me when I first played it because I was like, why is he trying to keep my sparkling stone? What if he's trying to steal it? I don't know you. I just met you today. Hmm. He's just like, <laughs> I'm gonna borrow this today. <laughs> I'll definitely give it back. Definitely. <laughs> mm -hmm. I don't believe you. Blah, blah, blah. Taking Jubilee to the place, doing stuff. Blah, blah, blah. Lily! Lily! Put your Cosmog away! I realize that he keeps trying to escape, but you need to put a lock on that zipper. Like, it's pretty simple what you need to do. That poor thing is gonna be murdered, probably, because of your negligence. <sighs> Danger. Danger awaits at every corner. Welcome back, Jubilee! Okay, blah, 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 that's right. We're all having a good time. Let's all have fun. Mom, stop talking. I want to move on. Yeah, I know. I know, Pop. Poppy. I should have named it Poppy, but it was a boy. His name is Bobo. Popley. The next day, what will happen? On our next day, come back another time for episode two. Okay, no, I'm just kidding. Episode two will... I will be ending this episode very soon, very shortly, two minutes from now. Remember, if you have not left a like on the video or subscribed, terrible things will happen to you. Terrible, terrible things. Okay. Oh, I can move on. Progressing the story. Oh. Who's coming into my house? Ooh, it's Kukui! Hello! Hey there, Jubbly! Festival! Blah, blah, blah. Pokemon Trainer, Route 1. If anybody didn't already know, I've already played through this game before, so that's why I'm kind of spamming through all this. But I hope you've been entertained by my commentary. I've been entertained by my commentary, so... That's all that really matters in the end, isn't it? Let's go on a Pokemon journey. Ah, <laughs> uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Kukui, my cousin, who's not really my cousin. Alrighty, let's follow him over here. Oh, he's gonna finally give me some freaking Pokeballs. I've been waiting all this time. Okay, that'll be a good place to end the, end the episode. Right after I get Pokeballs, the episode will end. Leave a like and subscribe to my channel before the episode ends. What terrible things will happen to you and everyone that you love. I'm kidding. Terrible things won't really happen to you. No way. Oh. That grubbin is not shiny. So I reject it. This is not a shiny lock, by the way. It's just a regular Nuzlocke. But we can dream. 
Well, that was a good episode, you know? We got our starter. We, uh... That's pretty much all we did. We fought, uh, how? Uh, no. We fought... Yeah, we fought how once. Yeah, it was a good episode. We named our Papleo Bobo. And he is a beautiful, majestic creature. Alright. Not even a critical capture, noob. Obviously he doesn't have the Pokedex filled out. Alright. Alright, Grevin was caught. Good work. I'm proud of you. Okay. Alright, got myself a Robin. Wild Pokemon. Great. Tuckered out. Oh, tuckered out. You tuckered out. Good queen. Finally, some Pokeballs. Thank you. Took you long enough. What if I had found a shiny earlier? If I didn't have any Pokeballs, that would have been horrible. Okay, let's have one encounter before we end the episode. Just one encounter to see. Oh, I should save. Oh, I can't find any Pokemon in this grass. I've been running around a lot and nothing appeared, so I probably should give up. Oh, oh, something appeared. Okay. Oh, I have to catch this. This is a Nuzlocke. Crap. I forgot. <laughs> oh no. Okay, well, uh, here's our first encounter on whatever route we're currently on. Oh, yeah. Oh, crap. Okay. Uh, I have to catch this. I'm sure Pound won't kill. Okay. You know what? I should just throw a ball. I'm sure if I just throw a ball, I'll catch it. Okay. Our first team member will be Grubbin. Okay. All right. All right. I mean, that's okay. That's not great. That's fine. Probably not going to use it. TBH. Maybe I will. If necessary. Come on, stay in that ball. Don't you dare. Alright, we got it. Got him. First Pokemon on the team, you guys. Good thing I remembered this was a Nuzlocke, because otherwise, that would be bad. That would be very, very dangerous. Okay, Bobo, you grew up to another level. What should we name our new Grubbin? Okay, Grubbin's data added to the Pokedex. It's a beautiful little Grubby. Little Grubmeister. Ooh, Grubmeister. That's too hard to say. I'm gonna name it Grubby. Okay. Larva Pokemon. Good. Yes. No, I can't name him Grubby. He's gonna be a Vikavolt someday. I gotta name him something else. How about... Well, I mean, he might. He might also die. And then we'll never see him again. But, uh... I'll name him... Um... It's a boy. A boy. What should I name you? I'm gonna name him... Um, Reginald. He's a very sophisticated boy. Reginald? I have no idea what I'm doing. If that's not clear at this point. I'm sure it was already clear. <clears throat> Alright, well guys, we just... Oh, I should look at Reginald before I end it. I almost was going to end it, but then I remembered. We need to see if Reginald has a good na uh, nature? Ability? Nature? Okay, he has a uh, attack increasing, defense lowering. That's okay. Lonely? Oh, Lonely? Oh, he's lonely. Sad. Right then. Okay, Reginald, you're on our team. Alright, guys, that's the end of the first episode of my Ultra Moon Nuzlocke. I hope you enjoyed it. I'm glad we remembered to catch that Grubbin on the first route. I forgot that this was a Nuzlocke halfway through. That's typical of me. But, anyways, remember leave a like on the video, subscribe if you haven't, and until next time, I don't have an outro. Come up with one of those later on. Bye, guys. I love you.